G'day, I'm Clive and welcome to CDP Outdoors. Today, we're at Grimwade Shelter on the Bibbleman Track. So the first thing I'll show you is where I'm standing. The view. Isn't that just beautiful? And to get the view, you've got a nice picnic bench right here, right on the side. And your fire pit beside it. So when there's no fire bands, sit around there and have a good ch chat with all your mates. Oh, I've got an ant, excuse me. <laughs> an ant on the camera, you might have seen it when across the lens. Yeah, so you can sit around the fire with all your mates, keep him warm or any other hikers that you meet along the way. So let's show you around. First thing we'll go to is the dunny, because that's the first thing you see as you walk in. And if you haven't seen any of my videos before, a dunny is an outdoor toilet. And these ones are drop toilets and they're composting. So I only put down toilet tissue. No wet wipes. And ladies, unfortunately, if it's that time of month, you have to carry it out with you. Because it will destroy the composting and make the toilet end up stinking. Smelling flies, maggots, all that stuff will start coming out of it. And we don't want that. Not every toilet has toilet bowl in. They're normally donated by the kind trail angels who come and look after the shelters and cut the vegetation back. And we fell over next to shelter we'll go back to. And I've noticed there's two arrows pointing to two different directions to the camp pitches or the tents. Now when I say a tent, I'm saying the average size two person tent. So when I say it's big enough for one or big enough for two, that's what I mean. And looking at the size of the benches in here, they're big enough for three on each bunk bed. And they should be very close friends, and then you probably get four on each. But there's three, six, same on the opposite side of the shelter and a picnic bench on the inside. So it's got this one to do tent sites of oh, water. There we go, got one that side. I didn't notice one on the other, just gonna have a look. And you're using the water, remember, it's rain water. And only the one tank, so be extra careful. Just use what you need, don't waste any. If these tanks run out and somebody comes in here somewhere and they are dehydrated, it could mean their life. So be sparing with what you use. There's this sign on from the way to the tent pictures. Oh, that's the new steps, but looks good. Two. <coughs> the first one is right behind the shelter. It's been not long by the looks of it. Being done. That's quite nice, that is. You can fit one tent on there comfortable. <coughs> and over this way is the next side. Try to squeeze to it'd be very, very, very tight. So, yeah, this is it, be the one tent in that pit. And I've got a log here, so you've got something to sit on. I've got a thought for that one. Keep going up. Yep, decent condition. Have a log to sit on. Oh, I'd just say comfortable for one tent there. 
probably squeeze a three person tent on there if you're a, a small family coming <coughs> This way. Let's see. No, let's go to these ones first. Turn on up. <coughs> We've got two more tent pictures up here. Yeah, they're all about the same size. I said, good. Two man tent size with room for spare or three person tent. And another one on that side. And two. Lots of seats. <coughs> Whoever came up with that idea, thank you, that's a good one. <coughs> Let's go across here now. This may take us to where the other sign was pointing. level as a rest but it's still nice and I think it's just slightly smaller than yours but there's your log to sit on again another one over to the left as we look down Picture, another one really nice. Got a log to sit on over at the side. See another one on the way back to any shelter there, but let's carry on looking up here. Yeah, and another one there. And it's got a log to sit on too. Nice size, good condition. Can't see any more over there, but it's nice. <coughs> Excuse me again. Two tents on there with a squeeze. So I said an easy one tent or a three person tent. And then we just head back down to the shelter. This is where I'll be staying for the night. Okay, hope you've enjoyed the video and it's shown you what the shelter's like. And if you have, please go down below and click on the subscribe button. Click on the notification bell and select all. Click the thumbs up, the like button. And if you are already a subscriber, again, I thank you very much. So until next time, get out there, have some fun and take care.